Guglielmo Marconi was born on April 25, 1874, in Bologna, Italy. From a young age, he showed great interest in science, especially electricity and physics. He was inspired by the work of famous scientists like Heinrich Hertz, who proved the existence of electromagnetic waves, and James Clerk Maxwell, who developed the theory behind them. Motivated by these discoveries, Marconi began conducting his own experiments. His goal was to create a way to transmit information over long distances without using wires. At that time, electrical telegraphy required cables, so Marconi's idea was revolutionary. He believed it was possible to use electromagnetic waves to send messages wirelessly. In 1895, Marconi achieved his first success. He transmitted a wireless signal over a distance of about two kilometers. But he didn't stop there. He continued to improve his equipment and in 1897 founded the Wireless Telegraph and Signal Company in Britain to develop and commercialize his technology. A major breakthrough came in 1901 when he successfully sent the first transatlantic wireless signal from Cornwall in England to Newfoundland in Canada. This proved that wireless communication could work over great distances and even across the ocean. It was a groundbreaking achievement that changed the world. Why did Marconi invent this technology? His motivation was to improve communication, to make it faster, more efficient and possible over long distances. Wireless telegraphy was especially useful in shipping, so... Thanks to Marconi's invention, ships could send SOS signals in emergencies, which saved countless lives. A famous example is the sinking of the Titanic in 1912, where Marconi's wireless equipment played a key role in rescuing survivors. For his achievements, Marconi received many honors, including the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1909, which he shared with German physicist Carl Ferdinand Braun. Guglielmo Marconi died on July 20th, 1937, in Rome. His invention, wireless communication, laid the foundation for many modern technologies, including radio, television, mobile phones, and Wi-Fi. His visionary work has had a lasting impact on the world. But